it's a bit damp. <laughs> it smells like it's out of the laundry. Hi, my name is Bianca. I am 25 years old. Dumpster diving is when you go around dumpsters to pilfer through people's trash and then hopefully or ideally pick up something that you think you can use or repurpose or gift away. I think I grew up with that kind of mindset that we have to make the most of what we have and maximise everything. I think it's just like very sayang, you know. It's like so wasted, like people throwing away perfectly good items. It's just ridiculous. This is one hot spot beside the central chute coming down. Things that are too big to fit into the chute, people would come down and put it beside. Here you would find um, furniture, big furniture, things that are maybe fragile. Um, so I would come here and then I would just scrummage through. <laughs> here also is another chute, so um, plenty of things here also. The recycling bins, the blue bins, I like to hit because people throw away just all sorts of things there, even things that cannot be recycled. So I would just open and then I'll just look through. I find I bring back a lot of glassware and ceramics because I, I think that, that I really can use them. These are some of the glassware and ceramics that I've brought back. We've tried putting plants in and growing them but they die sometimes also. <laughs> we have glass um, glass bowls that we use to put um, our overnight oats in and then we put it in the fridge and have it the next morning. This was the, the hoop that I picked up also. The one with the grooves and the bumps. Such great condition. It came in already like that assembled. Um, and I just found it beside the trash bin. So just picked it up and brought it home. I got a whole bag of J. Cho CDs and I was just like, what? Why would anyone want to throw in J. Cho CDs? But I'm the blessed recipient of this. I, I do get stares, so people who walk past, they'll be like, at night is a good time to, to pilfer through trash because there's just fewer people and, and more stuff because people always throw things like out at night. We have lots of toys, hangers, children's playthings. Yep. I open and, and I can immediately smell just something rotting, which I presume is food waste. If it contaminates anything, honestly, this whole bin, um, whatever's inside, cannot be recycled. La. Ta-da! Quite good condition. Quite stylish also, right, for young people. There's like office clothes in here, so it's stuff that um, I can definitely give away. Um, give my friends, give my boyfriend, whatever. Yeah. So I'm going to save this from this trash since it's also rotting anyways. This, I'm supposing, is an Indian um, costume. Which is very nice, look at it! It's like, it's, it's perfectly great condition, it's so new. Um, for me, I'm really active on the, on the online platform. So on Facebook, there are plenty of dumpster diving groups and people would take pictures of what they dumpster dive, put it online and then someone would comment and then they would try to arrange a meetup time. So what I usually do is I put it outside my place and then I'll be like, okay, um, if this person says it's coming down on like a Monday, then I say, okay, I'll put this in the morning outside. Anytime you just come and take it. They actually leave something for me. They leave like candy or like snacks. And then, then I come home and I, I see them outside like my door and I'm just like, wow. Just... And I know some of them, like, they, they really don't live off much. So for them to actually give me things in return, the fact that they would still be so generous, I think really heartens me. What do you call that? Okay, cut this off, cut this off. <laughs> this is just my own <laughs> speculation.